Good evening, everyone. My name is Heath Haskins, Code Primate, and tonight we are building. Um, so you guys have been watching throughout the week. Uh, well, for those of you that have been watching throughout the week, um, I have been trying, attempting to make anti-exploit scripts and stuff like that. So tonight's not going to be about anti-exploit uh, scripts. Tonight, I am going to be working on building. So um, this is the little town where all the main stuff is going to happen. Like... Um, uh, this is the place where you come and drop your stuff off and I want to make it where this is like a little town village thingy where you can actually get your house and stuff like that. Anyhow, um, one of the main things I need is teleporters like, um, like these things, this right here, this is where all the, um, hold on. These are all the spawn points and they're no collides. So when you guys come to the place, this is where you land. What I would like are these things called like binding stones. Basically, this would be the main town, so there would be a binding stone right here in the middle. And when you click a binding stone, that's going to be the place where you like come back to. It's no longer going to be one of the spawn points. It's going to be a binding stone. So, kind of like a save point in a nobby, but um, bigger scale, kind of, and changeable, like. You'd walk up to this one, you'd click it, and a little menu would pop up and say, um, would you like to bind to, and I even forgot what this was called. This place is called something. Paxel. Would you like to bind to Paxel? So this is the town of Paxel. And I just came up with that at random. So, Paxel. Um, oh, by the way, I did put myself in here. Um, it's not the real me standing there. You can take selfies with them if you like. But um, that was so I could get an, a match for scale. And let's build the no next house over. Did I check the bottom of these? Hold on. I want to make sure that my building materials are correct. Let's go to models, surface, smooth, no outlines. Smooth, no outlines. Smooth, smooth, smooth. All right. Get this corner. That corner, this corner, that corner, and this corner, that corner, this corner, that corner. Good, good, good. All right, and we need to lift those up, don't we? Wait, is this part of the uh, the model? Yeah, I made this part of the adventurers hall. I need to pull those out. This one, this one. All right, so you, you guys, are gonna come up and. Oh, come on, get, go up. Why are you not, okay, I can just scroll. Adventures Hall, you're going to be part of Paxel itself. That way we can shut down the Adventures Hall. And these are no longer part of it. Which, by the way, I can turn this into a model, but I don't want everything inside to be a model. So, we'll leave them separated out for right now. Just in folders. Uh, what should we call this? This will be the blacksmith right here next to him. Oh, oh, what are you doing? Dear me. All right. So let's make a folder inside Paxel. Insert object and folder. And you are going to be called blacksmith. I'm just going to copy these parts. Copy, right click, paste into, and there we go. Now we can start building. So, first things first, let's move my guy over. That way we get a, oops, come here you, come here. Get an idea for scale. All right, this, all right, somebody told me how to do this. Control S for scale, no. Alt S. Oh, what is that? No, that's not what I wanted. Those are settings. Shift S. No. Control 2. Ah. 3. Scale. I'm just going to put that down to 1. And then. Boop, boop. Wait, are we moving on 1 stud scales? Yeah. We're going to have two rooms to this one. Here, let's move 
move these out of the way. And I don't want it to be completely even, so once once I'm done building it, I'll give it a little twist. Um, shift, duplicate. Oh, control D to duplicate. Alright, you come over, you come down. There we go. Heck. Wait. Why is that not even? And then this, push back a little bit right there. Good. Sweet. Okay. Now, how high are these things? You get on to... Actually, no, you don't go anywhere. You're part of the pallet. Wait, no, those are part of the pallet. Okay, you're good. We'll stick you right there. And, yeah, we'll have it coming out just a little bit. Let's put the, po the post on first. Um, how tall is this? You are size, 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 one by eight by six, so eight by six. You come down. Whoa, where's, oh, <laughs> I'm looking at the wrong one. One by eight by six, one by eight by six. That should be the same size, right? Hold on, let's move this over. Come here, you. Come here. Oh yeah, that's that's the exact size, actually. So let's move you right over here, like that. Good, good, good. And good. Now just scale that down. Like that. Ouch. Uh, the posts need to be right on the corner, don't they? There we go. Move you in a little bit. Now, uh, since we already know that we're going to be doing the post, so let's go ahead and do Shift D. Stick this one over here. Whoops, went way too far. And then I'll grab both of these. Shift D. Uh, control 2 to move them. Right there. Good. Oh, uh, Control D. There we are. Now this one's going to need a second one. Control D. Go right there. And then Control D. There. So now we have our post. Now we can work on the walls. Um, I'm going to have the main door right here. So I should paint the terrain a little bit. Uh, just like a little worn path right here. I'm gonna make the size really small and we want what is what is that? Is that sandstone? Sandstone? Yeah, that's sandstone. So let's make a little path right through here. Why is that not? Make a little bit bigger. There we go. There we are. So now there's a little path to it. And I don't like how wide this has become. So I'm going to add some grass right there to it. And sandstone. Just around the edge. There we go. Good. And let's make this a little bit less. Uh, actually, you know what this is going to be. Let's change this all to sandstone over here. And this will be like a little training area for something when I get around to it. But we're working on the blacksmith tonight. Let's go let's go back over to the blacksmith. <coughs> so inside here, the walls should be just right. It's not going to be as big as the Adventures Hall. The Adventures Hall should be the biggest building here. Let's grab... <coughs> oh, got to go back over to model. There we go. And three to do scale. We're going to scale you out to right about there. Good. And grab you. Shift, duplicate. No, control, duplicate. You're going to be right on the corner. 
and control D to duplicate right on the corner. Good. Like that. Control duplicate. Oh no! Control Z. Get back. You are going to be a little small wall right there. Perfect. Uh, I will need these to be a little bit in like that and like that. Covers up the edges. And now, let's see here. Control duplicate. We're going to need one here. And control duplicate. One back here. So that should take care of the, uh, the vertical walls. Hmm. Now I don't like that because that's going to be uneven. But I do like this. This is awesome. Alright, you come there. Right there. Oops. Right there. And we'll put like a billow. Bello, billow? A billow. Bellow. Or something back here along with an anvil. And then the actual shop will be right over here. That or vice versa. We'll put the shop here. It looks bigger. And then anvil over here. Maybe some wood stuff here in the back to keep the bellow going. Doodle, doodle, doodle. Control D to duplicate and rotate. I'm going to rotate this like that. Good. And ooh, did that not work out? Wait, yeah, it did. Yeah, we're good. We're good. And this uh, control two, no control three. Do like that. And I'm going to duplicate this one and just move it to the inside. There we go. That way it's it's nice and even. It doesn't have that weird edge on it. Uh, which, by the way, if you are doing um, wall glitches, that'd be a perfect spot for it right there. Just saying. Uh, you can even come on the inside like that. So, uh, grab this, duplicate, come out here like that. Whoa, 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 whoa. Going way too high. Come back up here. Come up here. There you go. And this way one. That way one. Should I have gone one more? Hmm. How did I go over here? Oh, they're on the edge. Hmm. Oh well. We'll leave it alone. Looks good. And shift duplicate. No, nope, control duplicate. I always get that wrong. We're going to need one here. Control duplicate. We're going to need one there. Or we could have just one long one going across the whole thing. Link. Nice. Um, hmm. Let's make this roof go. Half that direction, half that direction. Yes? Maybe. All right. So I'm going to need this from you, please, if you will. Copy. Actually, I'm going to need that entire roof, aren't I? Ooh. All right. You, you. Okay, let's just do these first. And... Duplicate. Move them over here. Ooh, man. It's going to be messy. Messy, messy. Undo. Alright. Uh, not file. I want to go select. I don't know what all I selected. Darn it. Let's go back to select and just try that. Let's see what we grabbed. Duplicate. Control 2 to move. Okay. And we actually grabbed an additional part. That's okay. I got the main parts that I needed. Um, let's do shift, click. There we go. 
Get that out the way. Okay. So all of these we're going to cut and we're going to go to blacksmith, right click and paste into. Sweet. So these are way too big. We're going to have to scale this all down to size. Let's go ahead and grab this. Shift D. No, control D. Duplicate. Bring it down. There we go. Up, 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 up. Over. Uh, is that supposed to overhang some? Yes. Yes, it is. There we go. And this way. It's not all supposed to overhang, though. Um, control 3 for scaling. These don't need to be that big. There we go. And my little guy's standing there just chilling. What's up, all? <laughs> now, why is that off some? Oh, dear me. It's the positions. There's points on them. Oh, man. Are all of them off by points? Ooh, they are. So let's do control Z on that. Hmm. I guess it really doesn't matter. Let's go ahead and move. Pull out just there. How about you? Pull into there. There we go. And are you even on here? Why not? Move, done. So, all right. You and you come down here. Do, do, do. Do, 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 do. Do, 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 do. Sweet. I am going to need to duplicate one of these. Duplicate. I'm going to come up like this. We're going to rotate for half a spin, 90 degrees. You're going to lodge right in there like that. Perfect. Control 3 for scale. Nice. All right. <coughs> you. One. Uh, yeah, that's, that's by one. And down. And down, and down. I guess I only need one of these, didn't I? Uh-oh, it's not right. Down, and in, in. Ooh, I can't tell if that's even or not. I probably should have measured these. Make sure they were even amounts of studs. Okay, so if this is 17 high, and, oh no, so that is the center right there. I guess it won't, it won't matter because we've got this for the center. Yay. Oh, that's cool. Even though we got to come in one more. Actually, no, we don't because the roof actually hangs over some. Uh, we do have to move it though. Move, come in some. Move, come in some. And these are all going to be double wide. So, control three, and good. <coughs> Should go. Should go over a little bit. That way it's got depth. Depth, it's something that like, instead of just having a flat wall, that's what this is. The uh, the little intake like this, the little inlet, it gives structures depth instead of just looking flat like these things. Uh, I could probably go a little bit bigger with these, maybe even different texture so it's not the same texture as the floor, but that's just the way it is. Oh gosh, I'm running out of time. All right, we gotta hurry, gotta hurry, gotta hurry. 
I want to get the uh, the base building done. Come on, please, hurry. Uh, scale one, two, good. And down, 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 down. Too much. There we go. You two, come with me. Control two, down, 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 down. This is gonna be awesome if that's the just the right angle. Do, 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 do. Oh oh. Uh oh. Is that out slightly? That's okay. Was it out slightly over here? No, it was not. So we're going to have to scale this. Change the move. Control 3 to do scaling. Pull it up just a hair. I want it to go past the wood itself. That way it doesn't have um, overlap on the textures. And you get the weird glitchy patterns. Uh, 2 to move. We're moving by 1 studs. Can't move by 1 studs. So we're going to have to find the best the best center that we can. Which I'm gonna go with that. Why not? And scale. And down. And scale. And down. That's good. That is sweet. Okay. Now we're gonna need the rafter. Oh, come here, you. Come here. I guess I only need one, don't I? Delete that. You, come here. Move out. Move down. Uh-oh, not you. You get back. Alright, pull this down. Like that. Good, good, good. And in like that. We're gonna go up some. Ew, I don't like the way that looks. We're gonna have to scale these out just a little. There we go. Same with you, just a little. A little bit more. There you are, good. Turn this back down to ones. There we go. There's that. Control D to duplicate. Rotate. Um, let's see. Uh oh, what was that? Control R does rotate. <laughs> Control Y does redo. Okay. So. Ooh, control Z. Let's do move, control D. That's for duplicate. Now, let's do rotate. What angle are we at? Okay, we are one, two, three from center. So like that. That doesn't look right. Move. We're gonna move. Maybe one more. That's not right. Hmm. It's not right at all. Hmm. Let's delete. Control D to duplicate. Oh, is that not? That's not. Ew. Ew. It's not even. I don't like it. Delete. Alright. So let's actually do this. Let's stick this on there. That way it'll get the angle that it needs. And then we'll just do move it into place. 
There we are. Good, good. And one this way. Yeah? Yeah. Good. Mm, control three. Scale this down just a little bit. I'm sure like a lot of people are going, dude, we don't really care that much. It's okay. But I'm I'm very paranoid about the edges. Scale. Wait. Scale. There we go. Whoa, too much. Turn off the move lock. Come on, just past. There we go. Good, good, good. All right. So, rotation is negative 29. Copy. Watch what I do here. I'm going to take this, duplicate, and we're going to go back to the rotation, and we're just going to make it 29. The opposite of what it was. That should be perfect. Come in just a little bit, a little bit. Good. Like that? Good. All right, we got the little side of our house. Or sorry, not house. Um, blacksmith. Yay. All right, let's go ahead and go control. Uh, shift. We'll grab all of these. We're just going to do shift, uh, no, control D to duplicate it. And then bring that all the way over here. Maybe not. Control Z. And rotate. Move right there. Sweet. And I want one more. Shift or Control D. We're gonna move this to the back. Hopefully, it's long enough to cover it. Rotate to that angle. Move. Ooh, just barely. Just barely. But it looks good. Uh-oh. What did I move? Nope, not that. That was good. Um, can we move one more this direction? No. Ooh. Okay. Let's leave that alone for now. We'll work on this part. Grab the roof. Bring it down. In fact, just can I slap it on there? No, I can't. All right, scale. It's gonna go way down. And now I should be able to angle it. That is awesome. Nope, not you. You, come here. Just gonna go out a little bit. Oh no. Turn off the move by scale. Come out to the edge. Turn on the move by scale because I don't want to go in over too far. How far did this come out? That came out a lot, didn't it? Okay, not so much with this one. And let's grab here. Right there. A little bit more. One more. There we go. Then duplicate, rotate, no, rotate, two, three, four, five. Five is rotate. All right. We're going to rotate by fives. And, oh, 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 actually, can I just do this? Um, let's do transform. Choose the surface. That's perfect. Wait, what happened? No, no, no. 
You. Come here. Hmm. It's very off tilter tonight, isn't it? Why is this being difficult? Okay, stop that. Undo, 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 undo. Undo. I don't want the transform. I want the rotate. Is this rotating? Yeah, okay. Control Z. And whatever the current rotation is, I will do a negative of. And it should be an exact match for the opposite side. Control 2, Control 3, Control 2. There we go. Sweet. Looks like it's off just slightly. Can I go in one more? That's too much. Too much. Come back out. Alright, turn off the move. Slide in there. That's good. Sweet. <clears throat> um, that will actually be rather easy, won't it? How far over did we come off the edge? Okay. I want the same for both sides. So, oh, 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 control Z. Turn on the move. Pull this out here. Ooh, we're over our time. Okay, I'll finish the up the uh, the quick little build part, and then we'll uh, we'll call, we'll call it in. All right, Shift D to duplicate. We want to rotate right there. Perfect. Oh no, not perfect. I went over. Um, then I'm going to move. No, I didn't. I did the perfect. What? What? That looks amazing. That is awesome. Okay. So. How am I going to do this? I would say... Okay. Let's do this. Let's grab these. Scale. Scale them down to right there. Oh, a little bit more in. Move. Move you in right there. Perfect. And then you, you're going to move in to right there. Perfect. And now, I'm going to create this as a duplicate. But you're actually going to be a negative. And then I'm going to have to widen you downwards. Like, uh oh, control Z. Like this. Make sure that you're taking out both sides. You will be negative. Negative. And then, watch this, watch this. Those are going to be cool. I'm going to hold this, hold this, and then we're going to union all of that. Boom. Look at that. So basically what I just did is I made a negative out of this part, and it sliced everything for me. So now, even on the inside, whoa, it's not cutting through. See that? That's a cool trick. <laughs> Still have a little gap there. I don't like. I don't like the gap. Oh wait, that's because we don't have rafters. Um, can we just bring this on over? There we are. Good deal. And then same for back here. We don't have any kind of rafters. So let's grab this. Shift D. No Control D. I always do that. We're going to move. Pull this over like that. Oh, are we still moving? We're not moving on a scale anymore. Move to right there. 
That should be hanging out. Cool. Uh, control. Control. No. Control three. Scale. Scale this down some. Oh, it's really dark over here. And shift. No, control D. And we're going to move this right in here. Like this. And I gotta add some light in here. This is this is horrible. Um, let's just create a part. Uh, part, 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 part. Thank you. And this is just gonna be a spotlight for the moment. Uh, F two. Simple light. And insert object. Light, 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 light. Point light. <coughs> yes. Thank you. Uh, but our point light is going to be brightness of 100 and range of 20. There we go. That way I can see. See what I'm doing? Silly gooses. Bring that out there. Bring that out there. Wait, that's not going all the way over. It. Oh, I'm. <laughs> <laughs> All right, control Z Z Z, scale. Thank you. Hello. I was just moving it around. Grab this. Scale you back some right there. A little bit in. Oh no, it's off. Turn off the move by one. And there. Oh, there. Perfect. That is that is really cool. Um, let's see. I could take this portion out. Should we do it? I don't know. Maybe not. I like the angle. Looks good. Looks really good. Hmm. I'm thinking I could. Let's do this. Um, control D. There we go. You are going to be a negative as well. But I'm going to rotate you. And this has got to be exact, so let's, let's do f five degrees. And we're going to go one, two, oh, hold on. 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 45 degrees. And that should be the half angle that I need. Now we can do move. And, oh gosh. Down, down, down. if this is going to work right. Alright, let's go scale. We'll go up this direction. Ooh. Ooh. That's rough. And we'll come down that direction. That's good. Let's scale it this direction. Pull this up this direction. Good. All right, let's see if this works. Um, you need to be negative, and you're going to union with that one. Nice. Oh man, did that cut too far in? Nah, it'll be fine, it'll be fine. It looks good. Um, maybe. Control Z. All right. This does have thickness that I forgot to take into account. So let's shift that one. We're not going to negative yet. We're going to come 
Let's see. This direction just a little. And then down. There. Good. Okay. So we should see it on both sides. That can go negative again. Negative. Shift. Hold the roof. Union. Done. Very cool. Okay. I like it. I like the way it turned out. I like the way it looks. Very good. Um, let's... Uh-oh. What was that? Oh, no. I was looking through something. Okay. Good. Let's grab this. Shift. D. Nope. Control. D. We're just going to duplicate that out over there. Nice. We'll make some torches and stuff for later, but I'll leave it so you guys can jump in here and see it. See the awesomeness. Oh, i got to get rid of that stuff, don't I? Select. Let's just delete that right out. Sweet. So, here's the Adventurer's Hall. Oh, delete that as well. Adventurer's Hall, the scale. Now here's the blacksmiths. Yay. Thank you everyone for watching this episode of Let's Make a Game with me, Heath Haskins, Code Primate. I'm trying my best. I don't know how well it's going. I don't know if you guys really like this series or not, but I'm having fun. I like it. So, um, if you'd like me to continue recording me building this stuff, I mean, I can do so. Um, I don't know that I'm going to do the same kind of design for the next couple of buildings. I might change it up a little bit, but I would like to have this town all co coherent, co co coinciding. So uh, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe down below. As always, I love you guys. There's no pressure to actually subscribe. That's just something I have to say. Have a great night. We'll talk to you soon.